Hi, and welcome back to Calculating Drug Dosage. These problems are from Objective 3, which relates calculating oral dosages, and the majority of the time, these will be either tablets or oral suspensions. The first question, administer 125 milligrams of medication that is supplied as an oral suspension with 250 milligrams per 5 milliliters. The toolbox has the amount that's ordered, 125 milligrams, the supply of 250 milligrams of drug per 5 milliliters of volume, and the question relates to how much volume to give to get this order. The ratio and proportion is on the left hand side the supply or what we have which is 250 milligrams per 5 milliliters. On the right hand side the order for 125 milligrams over X milliliters. Notice milliliters matches milliliters and milligrams matches milligrams. In ratio and proportion problems labels on both sides of the equal sign must match in order for the problem to work work out. Solving this, 250x equals 625. To get x by itself, we divide 250 out. What we do to one side, we do to the other, leaving us with 2.5. Because we can look back and see we were solving for milliliters, milliliters is the label that goes with 2.5. Verifying our question was solving for milliliters. In this next question, order is 0.5 grams of KFLEX. You have KFLEX 250 milligram tablets. Give how many tablets? Our toolbox has 0.5 grams as what is supplied. Our toolbox has 0.5 grams as what is ordered. 250 milligram per one tablet as a supply and the question of how many tablets. Note, because what is supplied and what is ordered are in two different forms, we will convert this first before putting it into a ratio and proportion problem. 0.5 grams, moving the decimal place to the right three places, gives 500 milligrams. Our ratio and proportion problem shows a supply on the left side of 250 milligrams per one tablet and an order on the right side for 500 milligrams solving for X tab. 250X equals 500. X equals 2 and our label solved for X was tablets which is what our question indicates we were looking for. With this last Objective 3 problem, the physician orders 600 milligrams erythromycin. How many tablespoons will you give? According to our label supplied, our supply of drug is 200 milligrams per 5 milliliters. In our toolbox, we have that supply, 600 milligrams ordered, and a question of how many tablespoons. Our ratio and proportion shows a supply of 200 milligrams per 5 milliliters of volume on the left hand side and on the right hand side 600 milligrams ordered and solving for X milliliters of volume. 200 X equals 3000 X equals 15 and our label is milliliters because X was solving for milliliter. Glancing at our toolbox we see this question was asking for tablespoons. So to complete this problem and get it correct, we would need to know the conversion for tablespoons and milliliters. This ratio and proportion shows one tablespoon is the equivalent of 15 milliliters. So 15 milliliters of volume is the same as one tablespoon.